Senior Vice President of Imani Africa, Kofi Bentel, says Ghanaians must begin to question their leaders in order to achieve a Ghana beyond aid and make it a transformational agenda. He has proposed a constitutional amendment to detach the legislature from the executive to push the Ghana beyond aid mantra. In a panel discussion at the 71st New Year School, Kofi Bentel encouraged participants to question every political position and services rendered by individuals. This, he believes, will plug out corruption and bring in openness to achieve the agenda. Both leaders and we, the citizens, will find a way to hold our public officials to account and to make them justify every penny they spend on themselves and on the work that they have to do for us. Because I doubt if anybody will say that we don't have too much corruption, too much wastage within the system. Our government is too expensive. He further proposed the country acquires an effective and capable civil and public service. If we don't have a public and civil service that is capable of one being effective in their resource use, to being effective in the collection of the resource, and three, being a check on both parliament and the executive, we will not get to a Ghana beyond aid. Our civil and public services are extremely expensive, millions of dollars expensive, but it is doubtful whether we get that level of output from them. Finance Minister Ken Furiata, taking his turn, argued Ghana Beyond Aid is not a political rhetoric, but a transformational agenda in which government has put plans in place to achieve. According to him, government has put in place a number of programs in the budget to set the tone for the Ghana Beyond Aid in the past three years. Finance Minister Ken Furiata said although ambitious, some fundamental reforms which include cutting expenditures, managing public finance and revising public revenue will be required. Our goal of a wealthy Ghana of an upper middle income status will dictate that we grow our economy very fast, um, at least 10% on average um, over the next decades. This will require that we raise substantially the level of national investment from the current level of some 12.2% of GDP um, to 30% and above. Much of this will have to come uh, from domestic and foreign and private uh, finance. He added, government is seeking parliament endorsement to kickstart the agenda. The 71st annual New Year School is on the theme, Ghana Beyond Aid, Prospects and Challenges.